Hey guys, it's me Ryan from Ryan Studios and happy Friday. This is my Lego Hobbit The Battle of the Five Armies mock and this is Thorin versus Azog from the uh, climax of the movie and as you can see we have um, Thorin here who has his golden armor on that he had in Erebor and then we have Azog who has his um, hand and his sword. And now I recently got back into The Hobbit, I was into it a while ago, and that's why I have a lot of the sets, but now I got into it uh, fully, so I'm starting to make mocks of this again, and I really like how this mock turned out. So now I'm just going to remove the minifigures just to show how the mock is kind of uh, built. So of course we have the rock structure up here, which is um, has two, uh, two different main angles on it. It's built upright, and it's also built sideways, and that is um, made through these pieces, these... Um, uh, uh, bricks that are not pieces, but, uh, it, well, you, you kind of get what it looks like, and, um, I kind of blended everything in together, and I think it looks really nice. As you can see, we have some ma masonry bricks on here, and I used small detail bricks to kind of, um, just uh, have that flow. We also have some ice because the battle scene takes place during the winter time, and, uh, there's ice here, and then there's also this little connection here that I really like. This meets up with this, and it's about two studs long. I also like this connection here. We have this corner slope that goes right on top of here, and it just looks really nice and, uh, very smooth and clean. And then we have some, uh, snow pile here, and then the, um, the, they fight on a frozen river, which I think is, uh, stunningly, uh, beautiful. And we have this, um, clip on here that's supposed to go on minifigures back, but I actually, uh, put it sideways so that thorn can stand on here and then I, we have this uh, brick here with a stud on the side and there's a um, st um, piece on top of it so that uh, Azar can stand on top of it and you could always move them around if you want to um, we also uh, yeah so there's also some trans blue and some clear mainly uh, the trans blue represents more compressed water onto the gl um, not glass uh, ice and so where there's least amount of ice where it's the most shallow means the clearer the water would be so um it's blue bluish because it, it that's kind of how it looks in the movie i just used one screenshot and i think it looks really well remember to like and subscribe next week it's going to either be the star killer based turret or the episode 9 mock again because i just want to get the episode 9 mock out of here and you guys voted for this it, i believe it was 3 1 so um yeah, that's it for this video, guys. I'll see you next video. Goodbye.